Friday, October 22nd. I'm Natalie Del Conte and it's time to get loaded. The HP Slate has launched. This is HP's tablet computer that runs Windows, not Palm Web OS, which HP now owns. It's a 9-inch touchscreen device, which you can buy from HP's website for $799 starting now. We have a full review and specs, of course, here on CNET. And Google TV users are not able to watch actual TV from broadcast networks, ABC, and our parent company, CBS. NBC also told the Wall Street Journal that it was blocking its shows from Google TV, too. Apparently, the networks don't want you to watch the web version when you can watch the TV version on the same device. Google has not commented on this matter. The Barnes & Noble Nook is going to be sold at Walmart this holiday season. For starters, the retailer will have 2,500 Nooks to sell on October 24th. They will have the 3G and the Wi-Fi version. And be careful about using FaceTime on your Mac. The beta version of the program that lets you video chat with other Mac or iPhone 4 users has a security flaw that may jeopardize your passwords. A post on Macworld Germany shows that if you log into your FaceTime account, the password can be changed without an existing password, so someone can just reset and lock you out of your account. Apple seems to have disabled the View Account button, and it will likely be working on a more permanent fix soon. And finally, Microsoft announced Games for Windows. This is an online gaming store for PC games. The marketplace will launch on November 15th. You can find it at gamesforwindows.com. Those are your headlines for today, and that wraps up your week of getting loaded. I will see you on Monday. I'm Natalie Del Conte for CNET.com, and you've just been loaded.